One thing is for certain. This movie gives a whole new definition to the word epic. The Raid Redemption is written, edited, and directed by Gareth Evans. And it stars a bunch of people who I don't know. The plot of this film is pretty simple. You have this gang leader who is at the top of this building and this SWAT team is tasked with going floor to floor and take him down. And they're trying to do it silently. Unfortunately, they are spotted and, uh, well, action ensues. Prior to seeing this film, I saw the trailer once and uh, the trailer made this film look bad ass. Now for those of you who have not seen the trailer and want to see this film or actually most of you probably even haven't heard of this film, but now you have. Right away I will say, don't see the trailer, wait to see this movie because you will not regret it. I have seen a ton of action films. I have also seen a ton of fighting movies, but this one is out of this world bad ass. If you go on YouTube, there's probably a ton of videos that are titled like most badass fighting scene or whatever. This film has some of the most intense, brutal fighting scenes that I've ever seen in a film. Ever. Not every single scene has fighting. There's a few scenes that are more dialogue based and you know get the story across, get some more character development, and the film does take a little bit of time to kind of get rolling, you know, just introduce us to the characters and then introduce us to the problem and then start the fighting. But believe me, there is a ton of action. You will not be bored during this movie. At a certain point, they kind of bring in new story elements that really didn't make sense. It, it seemed kind of forced. Now, despite all the fighting scenes, and believe me, there's a ton of fighting in this film. And I'm going to sound like a really, really greedy moviegoer, but I would have liked a little bit more diversity. I mean, don't get me wrong, there's some really, really badass and just unbelievable takedowns in this film that, I mean, not even in a video game I've seen. But I would have liked just a little bit, little bit more diversity. I mean, I walked out thinking, what if they'd done this? That'd have been really cool. What if they'd done that? That'd have been more badass. But I'm just saying, you know, like, it's good what they gave us. Actually, it's great what they gave us, but just a little bit more. Man, I'm greedy. Well, when you give somebody candy, they want more. And more. And more. One other minor complaint that I have is that, um, in the beginning of the film, like in the first third of the film, there's too much shaky cam. It's nowhere near as god-awful as the Hunger Games, but, uh, it could have been better. Now, as I've said, I've seen a lot of fighting movies, and, you know, there's plenty more out there, but this movie may just have the best fight scene I've ever seen, no joke. Maybe the best. This film also has two of the most suspenseful scenes I've ever seen, just the suspense level is unbelievable. If you love action movies, if you love fighting movies, why haven't you seen it? Well, it's probably nowhere near you, so that explains it. Therefore, wait for Netflix, or wait for it to come somewhere near you, and watch it because this movie is just, it's really good. I don't like overhyping films, but if you love action movies, if you love fighting movies, there's no reason why you shouldn't watch this movie. Just do yourself a favor and experience this because you will not regret it. I give The Raid Redemption 4 out of 5 stars. I can guarantee you one thing. There will be multiple times during this film where you're going to go, Damn! Did that just happen? And the answer will be yes. It did just happen.